Set on 42 acres in the outskirts of Milton in Santa Rosa County, the Arcadia Mill archaeological site preserves over 200 years of Florida history. Florida was still part of Spain when the first industrial development took place here in 1817. Arcadia is the largest industrial park in the antebellum period of Florida's history. It started in 1817 with the Spanish land grant, and that's in the late Spanish period. And then in the 1820s, it was really developed by Joseph Forsyth and the Simpson brothers. What we have here is the largest sawmill in the Pensacola, West Florida area. The sawmill was just the beginning. Between 1817 and 1855, the flowing water of Pond Creek provided power for mills and factories on a scale unmatched in early Florida. Water-powered sawmill, a planing mill, a grist mill, there was a rock quarry, uh, many of the uh, foundation stones for Fort Pickens and Fort McGree, Fort Barrancas, were, uh, come, they came from uh, Arcadia ironstone rock. We also had one of the first uh, railroads in the area, a, a mule-powered three-mile railroad. Uh, there was a canal project, there was a shingle mill, there was a bucket factory, a silk cocoonery, and then the 1840s, the first and largest textile mill in Florida before the Civil War. Two Egg TV had the unique opportunity to tour the site with Dr. Brian Rucker, a noted West Florida historian and professor. He explained how local historian Warren Weeks and his daughter rediscovered Arcadia Mill more than 100 years after it ceased operations and what it looked like the first time he saw it. Warren Weeks brought me in the early 1980s and we just walked through woods and then swamps. I'm thinking this is the most desolate swamp in the world and then I started seeing stone features, stone walls and timbers. I said oh my goodness. And luckily, in the 1980s, uh, we were able to uh, finally get some, they were going to develop the land and sell it off. We were able to get on the National Register of Historic Places. I did some research for Warren, and the Santa Rosa County Historical Society was able to acquire some acres of the central uh, Arcadia Mill site. The site is now an archaeological park maintained by the University of West Florida. There is a beautiful visitor center and other exhibits. Elevated boardwalks and trails lead through the site where you can see brick and stone ruins where industry once thrived. There's a small entry fee for the Visitor Center, Museum, and Arcadia Homestead. The outdoor facilities are free. Learn more by visiting our website at tv2egg.com and searching for Arcadia. At Arcadia Mill Archaeological Site in Milton, Florida, I'm Rachel Conrad for Two Egg TV.